High school football kicks off for area schools in less than a week now, and one local team is poised to make another playoff push. The Grafton Bearcats enter the 2022 season in brand new territory as first year head coach Mickey Foley takes over the program from Rich Board, who led Grafton to the playoffs for the first time in a decade last season. With some momentum going forward, the message that the new coaching staff is looking to pass on is rather simple when it comes to their team's attitude. One of the biggest things we're trying to teach these kids is you've got to care more about your teammate than yourself. Uh, we can't play selfish football. Uh, you've got to make sure that you do your job because when you don't do your job, your teammates suffer. With plenty of returning talent from last year's playoff team, the Bearcats know what it takes to get to the postseason now, and they've put in the work to match their desire. Well, I think we all want to. You know, we've been working really hard <laughs> two days for the last three weeks. Scrimmage last Saturday played pretty good. It wasn't that bad. I think we'll do good. The transition to the new head coach has been a smooth one on and off the field, with the culture of the program that Foley is trying to implement having an effect already. Kids are buying into what we're trying to teach them. Um, the, as far as attendance and everything, we don't have uh, an attendance issue. Uh, kids are coming to practice, uh, occasional thing here or there, but other than that, they're here ready to, ready to work every day. Now that the expectations are set for how the program will handle itself off the field, Grafton has expectations for itself between the lines as well. After last year's return to the playoffs, there's a definite desire for more where that came from. The biggest thing is they they want a little bigger piece of the playoff uh, pie, so to speak. Uh, we got in the playoffs last year, uh, didn't perform great, uh, got beat by a really good team, uh, but they want to get to a point where uh, it's just not one week in and out. How are they approaching the effort to get back to the postseason? This coaching staff wants to see their players walk the walk instead of just talking the talk this season. Every team that they see on TV being uh, interviewed say the same thing. We've got the guys, we believe we can do it. But at some point in time, you actually have to put those words into action. Uh, we can say all we want. But if we're not going to work the way that a, a championship caliber team works, uh, we're still not going to be there. With week one now less than a full week away, eyes in graft in turn toward a renewed rivalry as the Bearcats will head to Philippi to take on Philip Barber for the first time in two years next week. The excitement is at a fever pitch. I love it. I can't wait. <laughs> Cannot wait. Didn't play him last year. Cole Bowl's back. It's going to be a lot of fun. Grafton and Philip Barber square off for the first time in two years at George Beyer Field on Friday, August 26th.